Welcome to the show. I'm Donna Rucco. And I'm Holly Morgan. Let's start by counting down the three stories at the top of the list. In our newsroom, here's Bradley Hazemeyer. Thanks so much, guys. You know, while most kids are just so-so about school, some love it. And we got one of them at number three. Six-year-old Adriana Duncan was really excited to go to school, so her dad strapped a GoPro on her to show everyone how awesome life is when you're in kindergarten. The bus! To set the mood, they put the video to Taylor Swift's Never Grow Up. Not that Adriana has a choice in the matter. Don't you ever grow up, can stay this simple. Oh, man, the principal giving high fives, the bubbles, the coloring. It has a lot of people wishing they'd never grow up, too. The video has nearly 250,000 views on Facebook, which, it turns out, is also a great place to donate to your favorite causes. That's number two. Donate today. Now donating is easier than ever because Facebook's just rolled out a donate button for all nonprofits to use on their Facebook pages and link ads. So, whether you're participating in the Ice Bucket Challenge, or you want to support an organization like the American Red Cross, it is your contributions that help victims of disasters, both locally and around the world. You can now do it with just one click. It does a lot more good than giving an obligation like to a picture of your aunt's kitten. From giving to a cause to giving back to your health, looking and feeling younger without spending a penny is our number one story of the day. I would have swore it was somewhere right around here. Jack Sparrow wandered the jungle looking for the fountain of youth. But for you, it's right there on your bed. Dr. Joel Kahn says, quote, sleep may be the most important health habit to conquer in order to set the foundation for all other wellness activities. Not just that, but the National Cancer Institute and the National Institutes of Health found sleeping less than seven hours a day leads to a higher risk of heart disease and higher mortality rate. Hey, it's way better than us telling you to exercise, right? 